breaking news. Breaking news now. now. Breaking news. We brought you a Also today, contract ago. negotiations have broken we down. We are at breaking point. The world today is changing. We are more interconnected now than ever before. It's never been more important to study international relations in today's society because we live in such a pivotal moment. In calling for a humanitarian... The treaty today fight. should do the job. They international are international agreements. What they call this emergency. But we also face a world that is full of what we refer to as problems without passports, things that cannot be resolved by a single nation alone. Global pandemic. And climate change. Threats of nuclear use. Or migration crises. You know, these are the challenges that we face in international society today. All of these require us to work together as an international community to address that. We need to have a core understanding of how different countries operate, their histories, their social and cultural values to be able to make sense of how we operate. The core part of international relations is breaking down knowledge because knowledge comes from those who were in power and those who are in power. So being part of international relations is being to take that knowledge, break it down, dissect it and say, no, we need a new form or this is a different way of thinking. The Bachelor of International Relations is great for students. If you're interested in working for the Department of Foreign Affairs and Trade, border issues, if you're interested in working for defense. But the Bachelor of IR is also important if you'd like to be a lawyer, if you're interested in working in climate, if you're interested in working in finance. That's because in today's globalized world, you've got to have a good understanding of international relations to be able to succeed in any of the, those fields. I've always wanted to work in international relations. I mean, that that was my goal from when I was a high school student. Actually, when I was in third year at Monash, I did a subject on arms control, disarmament and non-proliferation, and it blew my mind. And lo and behold, it's now my career. Studying international relations really gives you a perspective and an understanding of different cultures, different histories, different political sides and discussions. Diplomacy is taking on a different shape. You can see this with the way Young Australians are being mobilised, being asked to be involved in discussions, engaging, debating, critiquing. Studying international relations gives you, on the one hand, the knowledge necessary, the knowledge of the background, the historical background, but it also gives you very important skills, things like critical thinking. International relations grant you that, that skill, that ability to critically reflect the core skills that an arts degree really imbues you with and grounds you that I still use are things like written and oral communication, the ability to write concisely, to articulate your viewpoints and your arguments is fundamental to my job. It's never been more important to have new people, new ideas and new perspectives in international relations and you as a student studying that bring those new perspectives to the study of this topic. You can do that very easily at university. We have clubs, societies, we have volunteering within community as well. There's so many opportunities to learn more about the community that you want to be a part of. I joined the Monash Women of Colour Collective and that was a fantastic space to meet very intelligent, very articulate women, a social circle where you can have healthy debates the network that I've built here is foundational to my career. It's the reason why I have my career that I do now, and it's the reason why my career will advance in the future. The reason why I really enjoy international relations was the travel, the mobility aspects. It was the people. It was always people-centric, always about the people, and the thirdly was debating, being able to question the knowledge that's in front of you. Those were the three things that were granted to me being part of the degree. I think a lot of students think that studying IR is the only way to work for the UN perhaps or get into diplomacy one day. But it's a lot more than that. Once you've completed your studies, you have a very vast field of careers that you can choose from. 